having a cabinet full of cleaners for every kind of job. Chances are a lot of your jobs can be taken care of with just a few common products in your home. Rochelle Trotter is here. That's right. You have all the answers, I'm Ro telling you. Ro knows. <laughs> Make your household items do double duty, Corey. All right, we got vinegar over here. Now, we typically, got I see vinegar in the kitchen. In dressings. But you know yeah. what? Vinegar is a great household cleaner. It's the white vinegar is the best cleaner for glass with newspaper. Right. Cider vinegar is typically done in salad dressings, but it also is a wonderful way if you throw your laundry in. In the, the washing machine and you forget it then you open it up like three hours later yeah, and it smells icky. musty yeah do a rinse cycle again one cup of apple cider vinegar i'm telling you it will take the smell away like nothing you can imagine uh -huh. and best of all i hate insecticides the the, the artificial things sure. use uh, apple cider vinegar to one part sweetened water, little drops of a uh, dishwashing liquid, your own homemade wasp, bee, and hornet attractor. Just any uh, plastic bottle, cut the top off like I did here, and put it down there to create a funnel. If it's inside of the house, sometimes we leave the doors open and flies come in, then do a cute little mason jar, put aluminum foil on the top. It's got to be cute, though. It's, it's got to be, be a cute, cute mason if it's jar. In the house. Otherwise, it doesn't work. Otherwise, right. it doesn't yeah, work. Right. Okay. Salt. All right. We all have salt in our house. We think about salt just for seasoning. No, salt is great for spills. If someone spills wine or something okay. else on your carpet, immediately throw salt on it. Let it sit for about 15 minutes and vacuum it up. Yeah. Salt is also great for grease buildup. You have a pot or pan full of grease. Put salt in there. Let it sit overnight. I use salt instead of Drano in my kitchen sink. That's amazing. Because salt sucks the grease out. So you pour yeah. the salt okay. down in there, let it sit for about an hour, and then flush it with hot water. Beautiful. Last but not least, yeah. these roses. This is day 11. Instead of putting that artificial stuff you get from the store you when you buy your roses, no? I don't put that in. I put a teaspoon of salt in these roses. Where did you learn that? My mama down in Mississippi. We didn't <laughs> have money to buy that kind of stuff. Okay. So we had to use what we had in the house. Well, I, if salt yeah. is that versatile, salt, salt I, you know, I got to learn these things. versatile. Right. It's your new Drano. Okay. 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 Let's talk about some things people may not think about as versatile. Dry your sheets. Oh, I love Put these. those in yeah. your gym shoes. I'm an athlete. My shoes stink. I'm just going to keep it real. Stick those in your shoes overnight instead of buying those. I was wondering those. what that odor was. Oh, stop <laughs> it. Not these. These oh, are sandals. Oh, I, my gym shoes. Yes. My running shoes. Put a dryer sheet in inch, yes. each tennis shoe overnight. Okay. It will take the odor away. If you got teenagers like we have in our house, sometimes they have a body odor when they sit on the couch and leave the room. Instead of spraying that insecticide yeah. or, yeah, or yeah. that Lysol kind of stuff yeah, around, yeah. Stick a couple of dryer sheets between your couch cushions. It'll freshen your room. Last but not least, it is the best remover of soap scum on shower doors. I don't know why. It's the only thing I use to clean our shower doors and our bathrooms. I Who don't know knew? why. Who it knew? just works. Like Can it. I have your hand? Because yes. you're not going to believe me on this. Yes. No, I need your palm. What are um, you? yeah, okay. uh, we're going to use toothpaste. Uh, uh, why are you uh, rubbing uh, onion on my now, hand? Now, doesn't your hand smell like onion? Yes. If you need to remove oh. odors from your hands Now you're putting toothpaste anything, on my hand. Um, you can use toothpaste, any kind of toothpaste, as long as it's not the gel. It has to be the paste. Toothpaste is also good for cleaning silver, chrome. Put it on a pimple. You don't have pimples. But if you have a yeah. pimple and you have a date tomorrow, yeah. put it on a pimple and leave it overnight. Take right. it off. It also is good okay. for mosquito bites to remove the itch. So, so look, I shouldn't have any onion smell at all. You better not have no onion okay. smell. Smell it. It smells like toothpaste. It's, it, but that's better than smelling like onion, right? Or garlic. <laughs> that's right. news you can use. All right, right. Rochelle you Trotter, use. you're getting it done. Get I love it. it. Done. Rochelle Get it Trotter, done. everybody. We're going to break much more. Good day, <laughs> Chicago, in just a minute. Well done. Woo! Yes. High five. Yeah. With that